The magic school bus sleeps for the winter. It's fun to be in Miss Frizzo's class. Her Miss Frizzo's sh dresses are funny. Her shoes are funny too. He takes us on trips in the magic school bus. Our bus has powers, magic powers. We are learning about how wild animals live in the winter. We are getting our room ready for visitors night. My grandma is coming. My mom and dad will be here too. Some animals hibernate in the winter, says Phoebe. Other animals stay awake, says Ralphie. Miss Frizzle gets an idea. Let's take a trip. In no time, we are riding in the magic school bus. Miss Frizzle drives north to a big park. Look, Arnold, this park is full of wild animals. Miss Frizzle's trips are always wild. Animal Land Park. Danger, do not feed or disturb birds. bears. There's a black bear, says Phoebe. There's another one, says Ralphie. Then the bus starts shaking. It makes a funny sound. It says, Grrr. Do most buses growl? I don't think so. The bus has changed. Now it is the magic school bear. I can't believe it. I can't bear it. The real bear eats some nuts. The bus bear eats nuts too. Listen to all that crunching. It's driving me nuts. A real bear. The real bear catches a fish and eats it. The bus bear's bear does too. The real bear eats some honey. It even eats some bees. Our bear does too. It's getting messy in here. A snowflake falls. Then more came down. The bear finds a cave. This morning it was full. Now winter is here. Things go fast on Miss Frizzle's trips. The bears make nests out of dry leaves. Why are we moving so slowly? Then both bears go to sleep. Now they are hibernating. Did the bus bear just snore? It won't be going anywhere soon. The bears sleep and sleep, but we are not sleepy. Let's go outside, whispers the frizz. Shh, don't wake the bears. Miss Frizzle opens her bag. She gives us some glasses. I already have glasses. They are mad magic glasses. Now we can see animals hibernating under the ground. We can see animals in logs and caves too. These animals will sleep all winter. Why can't I stay in bed all winter? We see animals under a lake. Then we see animals on land. One is a big cat, a puma. The others are wolves. Water animals hibernate too. These animals are hunters. We need help, fast. Wild hunters don't hurt people, unless the people get too close. I think we're too close. Then we hear a growl. It's the magic school bear. The bus saved us. We go back to the cave. Something has happened. Look, it's 
amazing. Two baby bears were born. They're very small and they don't have any fur yet. The bears are sleepy. We are too. Soon we all are all fast asleep. I can barely keep my eyes open. When we wake up, it is spring. The bears are, are outside. The baby bears play. The mother finds food. The cubs are now big now. My book says bear cubs grow fast. Miss Frizzle drives back to school. When we get there, it is fall again. And the bus is a bus again. Hurry! We have to get ready for visitors' night. The visitors love our room. They love Ms. Frizzle's dress too. Does Ms. Frizzle bug you? N no, but her dress does. The end.